Hey, what's up guys? Funky Giraffe or Robert here, and today I'm going to show you a couple of camos I made in paint shops, some really easy, simple ones. I have tutorials on them. I figured I'd put stuff out there that looks nice and is easy to make. Okay, so pretty much to make the blue plaid, what I did is I got a blue square and filled up the whole thing with it. Uh, I just used this one right here, and that's pretty bright, so I went ahead and put another square all over the gun made it black and then I put the opacity to 67 so I just gave it that darker look on the gun. Um, for the actual lines themselves, once you, uh, when you get this checkered, you go to patterns and you get this checkered right here, it looks normal but then when you uh, toggle outline, it has these lines on the side. So what I did is I got the checkered out and I got these lines and I adjusted it to where I wanted it to be and I just shrunk it. And to give it that, like, that little look right there, like how it, like, fades, kind of, I went ahead and I put the opacity at 14%. So, that's what you see right here. And then the lines, um, to the, the lines, like, right next to the top ones are just really small, uh, rectangles. I actually use the letter I. I went ahead and put them and placed them there. That's all you gotta do for the plaid one. For uh, pretty much any royal, I can go ahead and just make one right now. I have the royal for the man of war right here. Really simple, three things, looks pretty cool. Um, I'll go ahead and do it on the Razorback real quick. Basically, you're gonna go to, go ahead and get a square. Fill up the whole part of it, like the whole gun, that's seeable anyway. Change the color to this gold right here. It looks like brown on the color picker, but it's really gold for some reason. Put it down. Go to patterns. I'm gonna take the alien pattern. A gun that's like the most part, like I don't know, like like the best looking part of it. Go ahead and put it on black. Just put that there. Put it wherever you want. Um, some guns. I'll go ahead and I'll put this on it. And maybe I'll put it like back here or something. Sometimes it looks cool, sometimes it doesn't. It kind of looks nice on this one. But another thing I'll do sometimes, or I'll do this pattern. I'll get these stars here. I want to put stars back. I'll go ahead and switch the color to one under that um, gold one. And it kind of just gives it that little cool look to it. So to make any chrome flames camo, you just take the gun, go to tools, get a square, fill up as much as guns you can, go ahead and go material picker, pick this silver chrome one right here, then you're just going to go to patterns, get a flame, fill it up most of the way, uh, go to color picker, I pick the third one down on the gray spot, on the black. Okay, to make a one, what you're going to do is you're going to get two squares. I would make sure they're not the rounded ones. Fill up about half of the gun with a white square. And another half with a blue. Actually, no. Fill more of the gun up with the white than the blue and then you're gonna go ahead and get patterns get the stars put the stars on the blue part of it and then for here after that you're just gonna get checkered go ahead and put that under the blue and the red but make sure it's on the like over the white go ahead and get red outline and you're going to do the outline, toggle that, line this up, 
And there you go, American flag. And if you want to go a little more in-depth with the USA camo, put it on both sides. And then on the top you can try lining up stars with the other ones. And then go ahead and put a white on top to line it up with the other stripes. Okay, to make the Crayola one, you just want to get your gun, go ahead and go to Tools, get the square, fill up the gun as much as you can. I prefer putting it on black, I think it looks nice like that. And then what you're going to do is you're going to go to Patterns, and you see all these paint splats here. You're just going to go ahead and put those on there, switch in whatever colors you want, put a red there. Go ahead and put a blue here. You go ahead and just put whatever colors, whatever pattern you want there. Whatever looks nice to you. Go ahead and I'm going to go put a... I'll put the green there. <clears throat> Yellow. Uh... Put a purple there, and there you go.